All right, welcome back to Let's Play Mercenaries Playground Destruction, part 26, I think. I don't know. Last part, we just finished catching the queen. So, not catching, capturing, verifying, something like that. So, uh, we really have nothing left to do here. So, uh, actually, I've been meaning to save this game, so I'm going to go ahead and save this. Yeah, those are my two files. The top one's the Let's Play file, and the second one's the backup file in case something happens. And let's medevac. Uh, I don't know if I've explained what medevac does. Basically, you just um, always go to medevac, pay five grand, and come back to the mash, which is pretty sweet. I can probably see myself using it later instead of just getting killed. Uh, you know, I don't think we have that many Russian missions left. I think we have two, probably. This one and the next one? Well, that's what it should be. Yeah, whenever I was recording this, I, I just... I was completely lost. Did this all in one day. Or two days, actually. So... Kinda got a little tired after a little while. Didn't break too much. Although you don't usually break during the game anyways. But even when you stop wanting to play it because you played it for so long, like when people play a game for four hours and they're like, okay, I'm going to take a break. I've been sitting down for too long. I didn't do that. I just kind of just straight kept going. Excuse me, I got a phone call. got to answer that. Okay, sorry about that. Anyways, back on to the game. You know, traveling with this thing is so much faster than having that slow tank with inspectors in it. You know, those weapon inspectors were taking us some awkward places like chemical reaction plants and whatnot. Shouldn't they be looking at guns or something? Or out in Nevada testing a nuclear missile? Why are they looking at buildings? Isn't that what a health inspector does? Go on in. Naomi, or I don't know what he just said, but it seemed correct. Uh, what's this one called? Ah, Bredenbaka, yes. Alright, my best friend, the mercenary. I take care of you, right? I take good care of you, and you help me out. Speaking of which, the South Koreans know we're here in Yongbyong. Why else would they be camping out on my doorstep? I need you to get rid of them, and the village that they're hiding in. Yeah, whatever you say, Sergey. Sergey a lot. Ah, more wigged out than usual? Hard to tell. So. Is this the one with Yusuf? No, never mind. I was thinking of an entirely different mission. Alright. Oh, I really hope there's no lag in audio or anything while I'm doing this. My computer's all laggy and slow right now. I'm not getting all the pictures too good. Because the AVG is scanning computers for virus. Such great timing. I wish I would have waited this 15 minutes then started scanning. That would have been nice. Alright, let's see what we got to destroy up here. Ah, some tents. Ah, I don't think they're tents actually, but it seems like the right thing to do. Um, is this the mission the with the... Being jammed. No, it's not. Oh, we just started the Russians. Never oh, mind. God, I, I'm... I've been thinking of something completely different. Okay. 
Over here. Bad South Korean people. I don't care if I have to sacrifice a few Russians. No, you're not gonna run me over. It's not happening. I'm gonna take down this building. I've learned the turret on the back of this thing is getting gotten pretty strong. Or it's, it's kind of tough for a launcher on the back of a truck, so... Three shots? That's awesome. Or the car could finish that off. Oh, I thought the burned car crushed the guy for a second. That would have been great. Oh, look, the Russian guy's still alive. Yes! Apparently, you have more than vodka within you. Possible methamphetamine. Actually, a uh, German scientist, I mean, German stole Russian scientists from Russia to uh, make methamphetamine before the Russians did, to where they didn't have to feed their soldiers as much, and um, to where they fight longer. And when they get shot, they can still shoot until their body actually dies. Which I thought was pretty interesting. They had some crazy stuff going around in World War II. Um... Damn. Okay, you really need... Oh, that was a fail. Yeah. Let's destroy this house. It really should only take three shots. Yep, yep, yep. Three shots would take... Oh, hello. We received an update from the contract. An allied tank lost its way near the temple. Actually, no, I'm not too interested in um, taking a lost tank somewhere. You know, every time you take people out of the vehicle, it kind of reminds you of Grand Theft Auto, besides for the part of the people who only try and take their car back. I was really hoping to run someone over with that. No! You are mine. That's right, you keep shooting at what you can't hit. Come on. Destroy the building. I'm gonna go hostile with South Korea, not so long. Destroy the damn building! Oh, great. Aha, a crate. Do you have health? Yes, you have health. Jesus Christ, did y'all see that? That bullet came around the corner of the building. They're doing some wanted shit right here. Wow. I mean, that's just crazy. Okay, how am I going to take this house down? Oh yeah, more shots. Sweet. Alrighty, um, two more, two more, and we get some money. Yeah, we're completely hostile against South Korea by now. Not a problem, let's go mountain climbing. Okay, I think a surgical strike should do away with all those. Don't y'all think? Uh... No, stealth fighters overkill. Gunships support. I don't know if that even kill it. Cruise missiles definitely overkill. Yeah, a surgical strike should do it. Simple enough. Me. Oh yes. Anytime now. Wow. It looks great, doesn't it? Another one. Let's aim you at the house. Roger, target received. Oh, when the circle got big again, I thought it tracked onto my gun. The butt of the uh, rifle I have on my back. I thought that I was about to hit myself with an airstrike. That would have sucked. That would have really sucked. Um. Let's see, let's see if we could, uh, take one of these and just destroy one of them. Let's see if we could take the other and get back to the Russians. That would be nice. That would be stupendous. But, yeah, that's right. You can't run me over when I'm in the car, huh, asshole? No, no, you can't. Or shoot me whenever you don't have a marksman gunner on the damn turret, do you? Uh-uh.
Um, okay, there's the bridge. Whoa, I thought I was going the wrong way for a second. That would have really sucked. Detour. We're going to take the scenic route this time. Yeah. Yeah, we totally just outran a missile, by the way. That's what you call badass. When you can outrun a bullet with your local truck, or Hummer, in a war zone, yeah, that's called badass. I think we're doing everything the whole other way. I like how the V can just turn around at such ease like that. It's so great. It just provides unlimited options of maneuverability. Over the bridge we go, over the bridge we go. Okay, no more bridge. Fall back! Uh, should we take a right? Yeah, I think we should take a right. Or, yeah. I don't know, I'm trying to work off a of memory on those maps and I'm not getting a, too good of a mental picture here of them. Sheesh, if y'all think me looking at the maps are bad now, I hope y'all don't think it's bad now. Because whenever I start hunting two through 10 on the hearts and spades, it's gonna be crazy. I probably should have uh, played when I was more into the game than just trying to complete the game itself. And into the Russian area we go. Kinda. That's kind of a ripoff for such a good vehicle, huh? Only five grand? Well, that covers the medevac cash, earlier, eh? I guess, so there's an upside. Stolen vehicle for money, haha. <laughs> Alright, my best friend, the mercenary. I take care of you, right? I take good care of you, and you help me out. Speaking of which, I've got a man in Shinuiju. He takes care of things for me. I bring him diamonds, forged passports, all sorts of things that are small and easy to transport. He takes them, brings me money. We all love money, right? I've got some items for him. You get them, bring them to him. I give you a cut. And, uh, make it quick. He's been waiting for a while already. Relax. I don't think we'll have to put up with him for much longer. You know, I hope you have a good plan to get rid of him. I'll go through with it. I'll kill him myself if I have to. Sergei didn't give us much lead time on this one. I don't think he gives himself much lead time. I think he's making it all up as he goes along. You know what I think? What? Sergei's operating out of his league, and he's getting more paranoid as he expands his business. Oh, okay. No, they're not going to give us a time limit. There's a number card nearby. Check your radar for the location. Yeah, they're not going to give us a time limit. They're going to give us deducting money. How smart of them. Okay, he's just right there. Deducting money as your time limit. Now, that's not a new one. Sure, we've seen that in different games before. Can't name any right off bat, but I'm, I'm sure we could. Are you money for putting you in the car? Yes, yes we do. Alright, next stop is... I think we gotta go meet some Russian guy. Which would make sense seeing as we're doing a Russian mission, but... You never know, I mean, we just pick up an ally. Yeah, those boxes are dangerous, I'm telling y'all. One of those boxes can send this car doing eight backflips. Not exaggerating, speaking from experience. Those are dangerous boxes. Especially when you have Hummers, because those things will just go crazy. Uh, do I honk? Do you jump on the back? Like, start surfing on the car as we're going? No, gotta talk to you. Nah, we're not gonna get the American guy. We're gonna leave him. I don't think he wants to go where we're going anyways. He served his purpose. Boxes, people, bullets, I want to get away from all of that. Oh, look, fire. I think that's a no-go. Let's 
simple little detour off the route. Well, that's going to be it for this part. Thank you all for watching. See you all later. Bye.